Well, hello there, YouTube, and welcome to Saturday the, what are we, the 6th, 7th, I don't know what it is, but, uh, yeah, it's been like this all day long, beautiful blue skies, sun comes out, thinking you know, come out and go do something, and then it just starts typhooning out here, it's just been waves of these crazy clouds, crazy wind at times, and then, uh, pours down rain look at the blue everywhere that's just so annoying it's like ooh, sunshine yay let me go check out the grass before I can even get my shoes on and step outside the door it's pouring down rain again and here comes the next one this is just what we've seen all day long these waves of be beautiful blue skies and just sunshine and all you hear is gutters still running because the waters <laughs> haven't had a chance to run off of everything yet that gun it. One of them crazy days. Crazy weather days. I hope it burns itself out. Wasn't it supposed to be towards the end of this week it was going to turn nice and stay nice? And now it doesn't look like it's even in sight anymore. It will change and then we'll be crying that it's hot and dry and we need it to rain. You know how that goes. Most humans are never happy. But uh, welcome to a very wet and at times crazy windy Saturday. All right, so it stopped raining here for a minute. So uh, let's fly out here and see see what it looks like out here. Looks wet, doesn't it? <laughs> Man. That is beautifully green out there isn't it it's crazy this is the uh, um, air 2s from DJI I think cruises along that's pretty awesome this is that mountain range when you look out my backyard that's the mountain range that you see out there. Is that cool or what? We'll row you out here way in the middle of the pucker brush. That's beautiful, isn't it? There's where uh, you should be able to see a mountain there, but you don't. As you can see, from my height, the craft is at 400 feet. And uh, it appears to be like I could probably skim off of that mountain if I was to suddenly turn around and, and uh, or I mean, just push forward and, and go right to that thing, huh? Let's see what it looks like down below. Got to be a lot of water down there. Look at that. What's crazy is not that kind of flooding rain, it's just that ever persistent wetness. Just to make things miserable. <laughs> and man, I see it getting dark on me again. And it's raining. I, I'm that lasted probably a because I went and grabbed this and um I came out with you guys and probably about maybe 10 minutes. So it turned from sunshine back to the rain again. There's the old barn that we're always looking out over. We're just kind of approaching it from a different view. And there is our property right there. We're coming in hot. That's me sitting here in these bushes. If you can make that out. That's cool that they've, uh, out there's the old, what used to be that beautiful forest out there that's no more. Cruise out there a little bit. Just got to keep an eye on the old craft there. It's funny, as quiet as this thing is, you can definitely hear it.
I figure I haven't done this in a while. I'll come down and let you guys see this old thing. Yeah. I guess we'll call it at that. Swing in here by the backyard. Try not to try not to bounce her off a tree down there. We'll be done. I should be right around the corner here somewhere. There you are. <laughs> it's already starting to see stuff. <laughs> Holy, had to jump out here right quick. Look at this. Heck yeah. <laughs> it's just been the craziest, very spring kind of a day. Downpour and beautiful. But enough about the weather. What else are you going to talk about when you want to go for a ride and you can't? And it's the weekend. Tell you what I can talk about. Look at the jungle. In one week, this lawn has become kind of hard not to because it is absolutely poor. And she's definitely getting some water in. Holy moly. Look at that. <laughs> How's it looking out here at the old barn? You look a whole lot different down here on the ground. Look at this though. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Look at them long casting shadows. I love that at the end of the day. It's funny, the birds, they'll slowly start coming out here as the sun starts beaming around. They all just like disappear when it's downpouring. It was heavy, heavy sleeting several times today. Talking about the roof feeling like it's about to cave in. Isn't it funny you don't hear cars or nothing out there? The sun comes out and all of a sudden everybody, not just the birds, everybody gets moving around. Like, ah, dang, let's go play. Poor gals, I'm so sorry. You're just stuck in here. Even the Himalayans that go play in this stuff are still stuck inside here. I ain't going out there messing them things up. You gonna come up and wash it? Or are you one of them people that just kind of splash something on it and call it wash? <laughs> I love people, I ride mine in the rain all the time and it's not hurt. Then you take a look at it and you go, mm, okay. Are you new to this, new to this thing? <laughs> that looks pretty rough. I ain't going to say nothing to you, but dude, that looks really rough. <laughs> I don't think I need this light on in here, do I? This is my little... Hero 10. Can you guys see that? I'll put you in there. I'll throw the light at you. That's a little GoPro light on it. It's a good little little add-on accent. That sure was nice taking the Slim or I mean the Road King and and Flirty out last weekend. That was really nice. I think it was last weekend we didn't think we were gonna get a nice ride in either, did we? And the old Slim. It's just, I mean, that slim is literally just a big version. Hold on. Oh, it's got a flasher? There, really low. But, um, what's the flash for? Is that an SOS it was flashing there? I didn't even know the thing had that on there. Guess I just turned it on, put it wherever, push hold and shut it off. What I was gonna say is the slim is nothing but a larger, more comfortable version of the uh, of the iron. I literally kind of think of them as the same. This one just got, you know, big, booming, smoother power. But if you got to have the have the iron because she's a little rough and raw, and I mean, it just has that pure motorcycle experience. I mean, I just love that thing. It's amazing how many of you guys have added little sportsters to your collection. 
And I get the same response. Oh my god. You're right. That thing's just stupid fun. It doesn't do anything special. It just feels like a real motorcycle. You know, it shakes, but you can bomb down the freeway with it. It don't care what you do with it. Don't you guys, you guys been doing this for a while. You had the old universal motorcycle. You know what I'm talking about. The old UJM, Universal Japanese Motorcycle. That's the way motorcycles were made. It didn't have to be Japanese. That's the way motorcycles were made back then. There was no cruisers, you know, adventure bikes, big touring bikes. You had one motorcycle and you set it up based on what you're going to do for the day. Or the week, or your trip, or whatever you're doing. You'd add some soft bags, or a windshield, or something for them big long trips. Some way of packing some stuff around. Or nothing, you just strapped everything down. The old classic sissy bar thing. That's still... Look how many people ride that way. It's amazing what you can get on the back of a sissy bar. And that's all you need. You just hit the road. You know, I like to have some good rain gear and something for warm, something for for cold, and and just oops, well, pardon me, lawnmower jumping out there in front of me like that. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, literally everything about your universal motorcycle. That's it right there. Literally everything, and to a certain extent, you can go racing around with your sport bike buddies, but their power and stuff will just leave you in the dust. But if um yeah you're in the tight twisties they'll have a hard time running away from you but yeah she ain't got that much power she's got way more power than the old himalayans in fact i kind of get personally to myself i get in a little trouble with that thing i just go too fast on it i mean it just floats down the road at 80 miles an hour like you're going 40 or 50 on a himalayan just whoa. Yeah, typical Japanese thing. They're just crazy smooth, you know. Love that old thing. I need to take Flirty out by myself one of these days. Seems like I went on a ride. You know, I said that in a couple of videos or a couple of days ago, whatever, that I haven't taken that thing out by myself. But almost, didn't I go riding through Windlock or something with this thing once? You guys have to tell me. I don't remember. Hey. Anyway. I just came out here to see how everybody's doing. Make sure they're they're all comfortable with the fact they're not going anywhere today, and probably not this weekend. Just trying to get this old GT out again too. All right, just a little pass through the shop. Of course, this Mother Nature. Thank him, you gal. <laughs> Right at the end of the day here. Now it's got to get all nice on us. It is stunning. The temperature. I don't even have my watch on, so I have no idea what the temperature is. But it is some kind of comfortable out here. And man, it's already crazy fresh air out here. Will you add that, all that crazy rain? Whatever impurities kind of drifted over and got stuck around here. Well, she's going down the drainage ditch right now. Look at that old barn out there. Isn't that cool looking? Mm. Mm -hmm. I don't even know. Almost makes you want to go out and take off anyway. I think it's it's after 7. It's probably like 7.30. So I guess about an hour, I guess. Yeah, It's going to be wet for quite a while. Anyway, I just thought I'd give you one more view out here. <laughs> Hold on, I was about, oh, she stuck her head out. I was about to say, I was heading in, I got a little sneak thing I was going to show you. What you doing there, Kai Kai? Huh? What are you doing, old gal? Look how clean you are. Did you hang out in the rain a little bit, huh? Oh my goodness. You old sway back sow. <laughs> you are a meathead. It's funny. 
Sasha's scared of her. Well, she tries to act all tough around her. And one day Sasha was, she was over there drinking out of the water bowls over there. And um, Kylie's out here, or well, she's in the barn. And uh, Kylie comes out and she like flies because it's a muddy spot right there. It collects over there. She comes flying out of that barn, <laughs> comes around the corner. And that Sasha about turned inside out. Uh, you're all tough until the big dog comes chasing you. <laughs> all right, I can sit out here and just stare at this. I might come out with a towel, dry off the little tables out here, hang out, and just enjoy the scenery. Very peaceful out here. Mm. Well, hello there, YouTube. I miss something. It gets this nice at the very end of the day. Of course. <laughs> Skies I, are crazy looking now. I was, I was you know, walking around here consoling the gals because they're stuck in here and can't go for a ride. I know it. You go, they're in there crying, going, half, it's not fair. Half tempted to go for a night ride, but listen, you can hear all the hissing when the cars go by. Whatever you ride right now is going to be messed up. There's another. There's another cloud layer back there crazy the waves of weather today I know. sleeting and... rain sun sleet <laughs> we're just missing snow but yeah i'm sure it probably is in them hills yeah if it's high enough and it's cold enough but it feels really nice out here though. it does yeah it feels good well, mama yes i have i think i've rattled on enough today uh, you ain't been in the have you been no no yeah, which she is was good. out here when i was messing around with the with the quad but she mm -hmm. was hiding out on the porch and you come yeah, out. Don't look at me. <laughs> <laughs> don't film me. I know it. But I guess on that, we can just hope for a nicer day tomorrow. Yes. Whatever it is. It is what it is. Yeah, it is what it is. We find stuff fun to do. Mm -hmm. We ain't bummed out. Nope, there's always projects. Yeah. That summer's coming. It's it's raging its way here, and we'll be missing wet days like this. Yes, because then we'll be crying because yeah. we're hot. It'll get so dry, all the grass dies, and everything turns brown. You think you're living in California? Mm-hmm. Well, Mama, sure. <laughs> let's go on and roll out. Alrighty. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. We really do appreciate it. We will talk to you tomorrow, same smoke time, same smoke channel. Don't forget to give her thumbs up, and you guys have a wonderful Sunday or Monday. Thank you. All right. All right. Appreciate you guys. Appreciate you guys watching. <laughs> Sometimes we'll the, the words don't come out of my mouth. I uh, know. All right. We'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> bye bye now. Mm -hmm.